You know, I'm glad that last video went well. In part because of everything we achieved here, but also because it made sitting through the damn Hummer in the background worthwhile. This is the most ambient sound I have ever heard in this entire game. Oh, from over there, I thought the game was threatening to have music, as if to defy me. <laughs> yeah, right. I need a formation option, that's what I need. Like, why are you assholes constantly pissing me off by choosing not to be in a formation? It makes Grimma sad. And Grimma doesn't like being sad. I'm not too worried about killing everyone. Uh, but I would like to prevent anyone from uh, coming up on the crew. You understand? I would also like to effectively switch between uh, my crew. Thankfully, my guys can take more than one hit. We're not playing uh, an old XCOM game where uh, I run myself into a poor position and suddenly I'm fucked. I should not have Stitch going all the way out here. It is a poor position for Stitch. You know what else is a poor position? That one. Yeah, I don't care. I, I love how the, the sound effects in the game there basically just said, Wait, he doesn't care? Dun dun dun. Alright. We continue the escort. Get our main character here, and Stoma whom I need to get more used to moving in front. Can we get in there? There's a door here. Is the door locked? I wonder if the door is trapped. Door is locked. At least it's not a... I see you! Being all sneaky. Perhaps you'll be a great friend. You know, he'll totally wish to befriend me. He means me no harm. He's like, hey, I'm just looking to have a polite chat. You probably don't see me over here. I've studied the five moves of doom. My name is John Cena. Da, 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 da. He's gonna come out and do those flying clothes lines. We're gonna have to derail those. Okay. She's failing with 120% lockpick skill, by the way. Which is rather alarming. She's not a bad lockpick. Uh, what? Uh, well, we locked the door. Okay. Well, that happened. Hmm. We're constantly getting experience points for that. That also happened. Look, dude. You're not fooling anyone. If you give me food, I'll tell you where the gate key is. Uh, it's in a chest on... Um... Really? I didn't like that at all. <laughs> His dying words. I didn't like that at all. <laughs> oh, man. Good times. Good times. Okay. So Stitch here leveled up. I, uh, he is still the best uh, first aid guy and doctor guy I have around. He is also one of the best people with small guns I have at this point.
yeah, I thought 125% would be the cap before things cost even more. Hmm. Well, I also do only have one skill point. Yeah, yeah, it's 125%. Um... Sneak could still be viable. I'm not entirely sure. I do like the idea of actually improving his doctor skill, though. Because unlike in the standard Fallout and Fallout 2, uh, Doctor seems reasonable to have. Ah, <laughs> uh, that guy was pretty fucking stupid. That was great. As if I gave him food. The chest on the roof. Yeah, okay. How about I just pick the damn lock? Save myself some time. Oh, shit! I itched my nose there, and I made a terrible mistake. Ooh, buddy. That's what I get for itching my nose. I got wrecked. Absolutely wrecked. I'm glad I sent Stoma out there to do that. Stoma is actually the one with some damn survivability. He's the other one on the team that has a, um... A leather armor Mark II, which was the best armor I could buy. Okay, let's go for it. Ow. Crouch? It's not quite how I intended it to go. Stoma. It's not quite how I intended it to go for you. Thought you'd do a bit better than that. No, don't try to... That was definitely a mistake on my part. But I did think whenever I told him to crouch, he would crouch. Stein's not that good of a shot. Stitches, though. We've learned about the greatness of Stitch's shooting. Well, he's good enough. I do like being able to pass through this gate now, though. That is funny. Let me go ahead and fix her equipment. We're probably just gonna use a first aid kit on uh, Stoma. Stop burning through so many damn med kits. That was rough. Love how Ice is still on sneak mode. You know what? She can be. She can have it. Alright. Stein. Go ahead and uh, take this first aid kit. Stoma, you stand up. That went very poorly for your hit points. Yeah. That went pretty bad. Now, this first aid shit does do better than the stim packs do. It's more along the lines of me having to fuss with it, though. Fussing takes effort. It also does give my dudes ex XPs. That's pretty nice. Oops. Good work, Stoma. Yeah, I probably should be using the first aid kits more until I hit the bandaging limit. Perhaps it's a mistake on my part. Wouldn't be the first one I ever made. But it will be the last. Well, Stoma, you proved yourself to be amazingly adept at taking the bullet. I see no reason why that shouldn't continue. There's bodies out there. They might have prizes. Your mission, should you choose to accept it, is to get the prize. Now, I know you like the big guns, Stoma. So I don't think this will really hamper you that much. It's kind of what you love. And really, who could blame you? It's a single rocket. Don't know whether this is going to save Christmas. It's an explosive rocket. But it might save Christmas. You never damn know. This could be the best Christmas saver ever. 
Now, how in the world are we going to get the truck through this? Or, excuse me, the truck, but the Hummer. Now, oh, there's another fence gate. A little hurdy herder growth. I guess we're making a quick turn. That's a pity. I guess I sort of need to deal these guys, although maybe I gotta stealth my way around. No exact telling. No exact telling. Alright, that guy is gonna be a hero. And Stoma doesn't have a great shot. Not enough to actually shoot, though. And I did say 33% was the, uh, the minimum. I don't want people taking two reckless shots. Kind of interferes with everything I want them to do, you understand? Maybe you don't understand. Yeah, follow tactics. Not the most enjoyable tactics game out there. And, uh, this sort of style of game isn't really my thing. Uh, there's currently a game that, uh, I'm uh, enjoying uh, watching Malkasphia play. Uh, called Templar Battle Force. I'm enjoying it enough that I actually bought the game myself during the Steam Summer Sale. Uh, now that is a uh, more enjoyable style of game. One that I'll probably record at some point. Doesn't have this uh, inventory management aspect. Uh, the interface is better. Which is amusing me too because the thing is, uh, the thing is primarily a mobile game. It's designed for casual user and use. Gotcha. Boom! Ow. You got me, bull. Ah, oh, shit. There was someone else back there. Oh. <laughs> oh. I, uh... That was pretty stupid of me. For one, I didn't run in with Stoma. But he's kind of been bandaged enough. Apparently my avatar here got hit in the groin. Uh... Looks like Stone uh, Stein here failed to do any kind of medical work. And as a result, my character's been crippled. Okay. Good work, Stein. Glad to see that all the effort I put into you. Now you're an effective member of the team. Good thing I brought along the secondary medic there in Stein. I thought Stitch actually tried to do something here. All right, fully healed. Winded, though. But fully healed. No longer a cripple. Winded, though. Eh, I guess I'll settle for you not running. That's my main character, anyway. Shouldn't be running and doing crazy shit with him. Stoma, though. Let's get him on the case. With all of the AP he has. Ow. So you like that. Those guys actually do have something useful. They have, uh... Oh, shit. They have... Oh, shit. You know what? I'm gonna ignore that guy. Think we can ignore that guy? I would like to ignore that guy. Let's just move on. Now, Stein, you crippled the main character. You did an awful job, and you deserve to burn. Oh. This is... This is kind of silly. And expensive on ammo. Oh, God. Run! Look. 
Looks like the civilian did a terrible job of uh, using explosives. Which is great. At least uh, Stein's doing something effective here. Oh my god, her! Oh, it's a rock. <laughs> That guy was knocked unconscious, and now he's dead. <laughs> I was like, why hasn't that thing exploded? No. <laughs> oh, shit. No, those poor, starving peasants. They just need to bite to eat. But I ain't hooking them up. I am not enabling peasants. I get peasants. Everyone hates peasants. Like, give me some food. I have a peasant. My life is meaningless. Uh. Okay, they're desperate people who are starving. As far as we know. You can't trust peasants. They're holding on to all the food. Bunch of crooks. I know a lying peasant whenever I see one. <laughs> Hi! Big boot. <laughs> neener, neener, neener. Didn't go so bad. Of course, there might be all manners of nefarious villains out there. Like this man who wishes to teach me some respect. How'd that work out for you? Get him, Stitch. Plunder! <laughs> yes, plunder. You got all of the booty, sir. Just to open up his inventory and find a big old bowl of bootios. See, now if he'd eaten them, he'd be alright. But he hadn't. That's the problem. Okay. Well, I've really enjoyed my name chatter with you people, but... Maybe we can actually make some progress, yeah? Let's rush up the stairs without using any sort of like stealth. Go, 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 now, all I need to do is get Stoma out of there. Can you make it? What if I told you to run down the stairs? Could you do it? Could you leave those raiders behind? You could. Great. Because I don't feel like killing them. I don't have to. I don't think the loot they'll drop me will be very worthwhile. That is most definitely a mine. I have chosen a terrible position. My character who can only walk somehow managed to get wounded again. I would like you to shoot that. Could you shoot that for me? No. I see. Well, we don't have any trap skill. And I don't have any peasants to lure. The target can't get any more dead. Oh, boy. You know, I'd probably be able to disarm if I shot the damn rocket launcher, huh? I wonder. How much damage would that thing do? 
Because I might just run the damn thing over. How effective do you think it is on a scale from one to effective? Write your answers in the comments below. Surely that mind could not detect a stealth individual such as myself. Hmm. No, I need to stop wanting to use my main character here. As good as he is. Thinking about using that rocket on top. There is that. It'd be a shame to waste that rocket. I want to put it to good use. Those bloody fools. Worked out a little bit differently than what I thought it would. Wait till I find those bastards. I'm gonna get them good. I'm gonna enjoy this. Would someone. Oh. Okay, this is your chance, Doma. <laughs> Well, you have to make it worth it now. Oh, he doesn't have enough action points. He can't even shoot this thing. All right. That, that went terrible. <laughs> you can't even shoot it. What the hell? It's because the game has assigned him this bruiser quality. Uh, he has fewer action points, so he legit can't shoot the rocket launcher. I found you a big gun! Ha! <sighs> God damn it. Of course, there's a fucking mine over there. Because why wouldn't there be? I don't have anyone who's going traps. I don't feel confident at all in attempting to disarm those things. Let me check to confirm. best I have, who's not in the vehicle, would be my main character. That's bad. At least I know they're mines. It's useful knowledge. If I kneel you down, will you have a reasonable enough shot to, like, outrange them? You found a trap, that's good. Don't trigger that. Right, 3% doesn't really count as useful. Okay, good, you found a trap. This will certainly be a perilous endeavor. But we're not doing a bad job, all things considered. I'm still sad over the fact that, you know, Stoma can't use the rocket launcher. But, well, what can you do? Boy, this is gonna be some... Who knows how many mines there are, right? This fucking city. 
This Hummer, full of supplies, just couldn't, like, move these sandbags or anything. Suddenly, like, create a makeshift ramp. How did that one guy manage to keep uh, this thing safe? Maybe no one wanted to risk going up that close to him? They weren't desperate enough for the food? Oh, with the turning on this, too? Okay, you know... These might not be hard to disarm. There is that. These might be relatively simple to disarm, so long as you can spot them. I mean, surely the game wouldn't make a... Yeah! It was already disarmed? I guess so. It was there as, like, an example. That makes sense. Or I guess you could maybe attempt to do cre uh, um, supremely careful driving. Looks dangerous. Maybe that's a that's another reason why I couldn't shoot it, despite the fact that I wanted to shoot it. That could be it. I wanted to shoot the damn mine, but that one was already dis um, disabled, so I couldn't get it done. Okay. Well, now that we spotted these, we will shoot them. I, I thought that was silly not being able to shoot the damn mine. I'm glad we solved that mystery, though. I'll have the main character do this. I mean, uh... Skill-wise, he's not the best. Uh, Stitch is the best. Uh, because he's a team player. Stitch, the fuck are you going, buddy? Other than to piss me off, land. Stitch. Stitch, I wanted you to shoot that. Are you going to disarm the thing? Hey, Stitch, if you are. I don't have to tell you. Yeah, yeah, that's what I thought, buddy. I wanted you to shoot the damn thing. Like, there's a crosshair there. I don't want you to automatically go to, like, Mama, disarm that! No. I want you to shoot it. How could you miss that? How? How did you miss? How are you missing it? Are we really having this moment right now? You have an amazing chance to hit! How did you... Was that with five shots that you messed with? You know what? Stitch, you are an eternal disappointment. No one loves you, and you deserve to burn. I wonder what that percentile chance means then. Because that's not something that's increasing as I'm getting closer. And Stitch had a... Maybe it's like a perception-based thing? To like, spot the mine? That wouldn't make sense. I don't know what the hell that means. Can't be an odds to hit it. But it did change whenever I switched weapons. Oh, fucking finally. I'm glad you succeeded. I'm glad you're a winner. Probably the first time that ever happened to you in your entire damn life. Let me just go ahead and piss away ammo. It's not as if that's important. Don't worry, the main character will join you in being shitty. You know what? Just stop. Why? Will you see it better if you stand up? No, stop. Stop, you're just... Can't even begin to describe how disappointed I am in every single one of you sons of bitches right now. Rebecca, in theory, you're good at the sniping shit. In practice, you're not as good as some of the other people on the team. But if you're standing next to the lead character here, he might be able to coach you. Okay, I just need to concede that ammo is not an object. Why did I do that? 
Here I go, walking ahead with the main character again. Come on, guys, you can do it. Good work, Stitch. Alright, that may have cleared the way enough. Unfortunately, this isn't like a like an unreal tournament hellbender. Can't have great fortune and success with this. Let's hope there's no more mines. I see you there. You're shaking that ass. Boo! Boo! Stitch got hurt there. That's okay. You got targeted. That's not okay. Who the hell is shooting you? Shooting at you, rather. The world may never know. You're still getting shot at. No, seriously. Who the hell is doing that? It's pissing me off. I don't care if I bumble into some bullets, I'd like to find the bastard who's doing that. But the future refused to change. Oh, wow, you had a, quite a few grenades. That would have been a headache. Apparently Stoma down here is the one being shot at. You too had shit tons of grenades. Neat. Okay, who, where, whoever or wherever this guy is, he's being a pain in the ass. Okay, good. No! You found a trap. I'm dying, Bolt. I knew that Psycho would make me faster. Come on and get Psycho! Just shoot that. Don't walk next to it. I pressed the wrong mouse button. Shoot it. One shot. Amazing. Shit, I thought this was gonna be some kind of challenge. <laughs> That's exactly how I interpreted that. Stitch got pretty fucked up. Unsurprisingly. Since I had everyone, you know... Stand out there in the fucking open doing a circle jerk. What a surprise that he got hurt. I mean, really, wow. We're gonna have to buy some more of these medical things, man. Stein hit Rebecca, huh? That's not good. Okay. We finished using all that. I like how I'm not even bother bothering to try to do first aid with Stein. After, you know, crippling the main character. <laughs> like, what a waste. Until really they don't feel like going through that ordeal again. But yeah, I'll probably have to spend the shekels on buying some more medical shit once we get back to base. And I'm no longer winded. First aid managed to fix that, which is great. Time for me to go get the lead character killed. That's how that works, right? Can't really say I uh, much understand or care for what's happening in there. We have our Vault of the Future posted. Music's uh, doing its thing. Uh, 
Stoma has been bandaged so much that he uh, can no longer be bandaged. Which is a damn pity. Put the dogs out there in the distance. What's our ammo doing? Really, we're pretty good across the board, huh? Yeah, we got plenty of shots. Isis, of course, is amazing. You know, if I'd had Stein be the driver here, this vehicle probably would have been wrecked. It's good that Ice is doing it, although... It's a pity that Ice is capable as she is. I just don't know how to get anyone of a damn vehicle. I'm sure. I'm sure the comments will tell me. That's what I get for not using the burst fire. Who could have resolved that situation? Oh god, peasants! 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 Damn it, peasants! Stop being- it feels so empowered. Yeah. That was amazing. Good work, peasants. Fucking peasants. No one's tickled by your peasantry. No, I'm starving. I'm gonna hit you with this rock. You can't eat this. I love how Stone is just standing there watching her while we wait for his uh, action points to recharge. I'm sure they don't have anything useful on them. I mean, maybe some healing powders. Maybe. This looks like hell. I'm willing to confirm right now that's hell. Alright, this mission hasn't been so bad. It's because I'm escorting myself. I'm not having to follow an AI into hell. You know, also, Ice does have 200 hit points back there, so I could at some point, like, make a dash. Perhaps I could have even ran through the minefield. I doubt it. Right, I don't know what hell awaits me in here. Maybe I should try sneaking for once in my life. What's going on in here, guys? Cool dudes doing cool things. This is cool guys club. Cool guys. Eh? Shit. So that happened. Not that I'm surprised. But that happened. Let's go ahead and move my dudes into position here. Some semblance of a... Hmm. Position? Hmm. I saw you over there. You can't trick me. The gingerbread man. Whoa! Peasants! That burst weaponry really, uh, really fucked up Stein there. You know what? You deserve that asshole. After what you did to the lead character, you're not even gonna get some first aid treatment. Get out of my face. Having some beautiful effects there with all the damn civilian blood. It's making everything look beautiful. Getting shot at. Oh, that is a lot of dudes. 
I can see why the raiders and civilians would be working together, though. If they all want food. Particularly since the raiders are the ones who have guns. If they demand it, uh, the civilians are hard-pressed not to play along. Stein, you have become like the Vic of my team. You do not want to be the Vic of my team. Spoiler alert. Go along, Rebecca. Okay, not bad. Hmm. In poor positioning. Let's see if I can fix that by running for the building here. Nothing I really want. What happens if I go up the stairs? We have a friend. He's being kept on lockdown by Rebecca. She's doing a great job. Guten Jorben, Becky. Get him. Oh, shit. That was noted as a barricade. I didn't think it was explosive. Ah, damn it. Fuck. That's not too far back. But that's a nuisance. Now I could have let Rebecca die there and that'd be the end of her forever and ever, but, you know... I am a merciful player. One who will grit his teeth and replay the content. For I am a generous god. One who decided to use the barricade as cover without realizing it was explosive. You know, I was looking for flammable signs. I didn't see them, and perhaps that's on me. Fucking peasants. Talk about being mobbed. Get the peasants! Stop them from hurting me! peasant approach. I don't know how the hell that peasant did so well hitting Stein. What do you have on you? Ah. Dynamite. Maybe I should have checked out more of these peasants, because that's kind of spooky. They had explosives. At least she did. You know, explosives are something that's of value to me. Molotov cocktails there. Yeah, there might be a, a point where I assault like a fortified position. And I actually bother to use all these throwables. I am carrying them around on Stoma. I don't have anyone who's really good at throwing. But uh, you throw enough times, you'll probably hit something. Alright, that's my fault. I saw him and I didn't fucking stop moving. All out of a lust. Lust for a thing. That's my bad. That's my bad. Not entirely sure I want anyone to, uh, stitch him up again, as it were. Because I saw how effective that was the last time he had that applied to him. So, I'll put a few uh, stim packs on. Not a big deal. Okay, so you don't know how to get through there like they did. You're kind of flummoxed. Yeah, you don't know. Da uh, uh, oh. 
Well, I mean, I did see them run through there like that, so it does make sense that there was a door there. Yeah, yeah. It makes sense. Ah! Rude! Of course, my game is lagging as I'm recording and all these crazy transitions are occurring. Bastard. Well, you won't have to worry about getting him anymore. Gonna need a stim pack for that one? You're gonna need more than a stim pack when I'm through with you, buddy. Let me get- just get away from that damn building. <laughs> Cause all the layer transitioning is fucking with my ability to do shit. Just tell me here, was taking a load off his feet. Rebecca got blowed up. Amazing skill and ability being used right here on this assault, guys. High quality Griffith action. Rebecca getting fucked up. Let me go ahead and transition her out. it makes sense that they would explode because you'd have to clear the way somehow, right? Doesn't mean I have to like it. We have multiple severely injured members of the team. Let's see if you have anything of merit. The answer to that question is, eh. I'm gonna leave this weaponry for the next set of bandits who'd want to come in and Take over. Now that we're done with these bandits, such is the way of banditry. It's a legacy, really. That's why I like to think of it as. Oh man, music! All kinds of spook fest! Holy shit! I don't even know how you guys are missing these things. I'd like you to stop it. Okay. Well, thankfully, we're about out of Bacomb. This wonderful area of escorting shenanigans is about done. We can move on to happier things. Now, how did those other barricades not chain explode after that? That's what I want to know. Like, how did the one in the middle not blow up the other two? It's kind of bullshit. Well. That's enough of my vision. We'll have to call that a victory. I hope. Please. Please to be. Everyone getting here. Nice. You've uh, pretty much been able to relax this mission. Let me tell you how much I like the driving mechanics in this game. The most outstanding pathfinding anywhere in video gaming today. We did it, though. At ease, warrior. You carried out your objectives to the letter. I have received word that our supply vehicle has reached our expansion base, which is now thriving. This will be the last time our supply vehicles are hindered. 
As we speak, there are three extermination squads being dispatched to Macomb to remove the assorted riffraff. Those who aren't killed will pay back the Brotherhood's generosity by serving in labor camps. Your vigilance and your perseverance has not gone unnoticed. Fine job, warrior. Dismissed. Happy camps. Yay. Everyone likes happy camps. Well, supply vehicles won't be hindered anymore. That's good. Everyone's pretty happy about that. Prioria? That's great and all. What? The cockroaches? No. Ghouls? I don't want a rematch. I want a rematch. Oh. What? We're... S We're gonna have to figure out a way to get out of that vehicle, boys and girls. I think this will be a great point for me to end the fucking session, because I won't know how to get out of the damn vehicle. <laughs> have to look it up in the instruction manual. Get out. Oh, she shot. Is this your life right now? The driver of a vehicle? Is this who you are? I guess we could store things in the vehicle. That's neat. Hey, go! How's it going, buddy? Neat. Well, we took a single hit point worth of damage, and ice leveled. Most everyone leveled. Splendid. Good job, team. I guess this vehicle is ours now. I. Thought we would no longer have it. That's cool. Not really sure how I feel about this, though. Ah. Damaged the Hummer for four points of damage. That's good. Glad to see terrain damage exists. Maybe I shouldn't have fought the ghouls after all. Okay! <laughs> That ends, uh, yeah, that was a great warm-up to get back into the game. We had some combat there with ice at the end. She got to flex her muscles. Rebecca and Stitch are still, uh, roughed up a bit. But yeah, escort mission done, and we have ourselves a vehicle. Neat. I'm getting really damn sick of that engine sound, though. If I tell you to do something with someone, will you get out of the vehicle? <sighs> this game. Alright folks, I'm out of here. Take care.